Orono Mount Fire Department leading the parade for us. They've been a big help. Uh, support the Thin Blue Line. Give these guys a hand as they come by. Say hi to them, kids. Tom Casey, Seth Iverson is with me this morning. Say hi, Seth. Hi. Next, we got Minnetonka American Legion Honor Guard. Post 398. American Legion is the largest veterans organization in the United States, with over 3 million members. Let's give them the stage. The Honor Guard consists of members in good standing from the American Legion Post, Sons of the American Legion, and the American Legion Auxiliary. Thanks for all you do, you guys. Led by Sergeant of Arms Bobby Conkey. Next is a Minnet Minnetonka American Legion post, color guard. Yeah, the color guard's through, and here comes the candy. Got to wave while you throw the candy, you guys. There you go. Coming through, we have Marshall Weber handing out flags, bomb pops. Thanks, you guys. The Riders is a group of riders who are American Legion, sons of American Legion and artillery. Raise money for the post, for the Children's Hospital, and other related charities. Mount Fire. On fire. The rescue squad. I think the rest of the trucks are coming back at the end of the parade. Oh, a big dance. When's the dance? October 9th. Everybody, go out and support these guys that protect us. Thank you guys for all you do. This is the Lake Minnetonka Power Squadron. Power Squadron is a nationwide boating organization. They teach the kids. If you got a if you got a kid that needs to learn to drive, these guys do a great job. Uh, our members learn boating, still engage with boating friends, and connect with the boating community. Power Squadron is a diverse, inclusive organization with members from all walks of life. We welcome power boaters, sailors, and paddlers who are looking to learn more about boating. And they've got a great spot out on the island. Beware of fine candy. Uh, okay, so this is Jubilee. Yeah. Okay, next up is Jubilee Foods. Wherever you want to go there. Next up is Jubilee Foods. Jubilee is throwing out the dots, the ice cream. Get ready for this one, kids. You want to get these guys. Jubilee Foods was established in 1985. Over at the old location across the street, their locally owned grocery store. Great group of people. And if it wasn't for Todd, it would all fall apart right there. Take, take some from Todd. There it is. Just <laughs> 
This is the West Tonka food shelf. Handing out food, that's what they do right there. Let's hear it, these guys do a great job of supporting the community. You can always buy a bag to donate at Jubilee Foods. Help these guys out, they do a great, great job in the community. And this, we have the Food Shelf Fairy. There she is. Yeah, good morning. My favorite, the Minions in town. Beedo, Beedo, Beedo. the Kemp's food car with the food cow make sure to buckle up cow <laughs> be safe thanks for being in the parade you guys Feel free to walk up. The cow looks like he's giving away high hoofs, a high five, a high hoof. Is that what cows do? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh boo. <laughs> This is Abracadabra, one of our biggest sponsors. Abracadabra has put a lot, oh, put a lot of time and a lot of money into the festivities this weekend. Let's give them a hand as they come by. Abracadabra has been around since 2005. Family operated by Matt Eichmann and his team. They provide the absolute best, giving their customers peace of mind. Uh, and they're, you know what, they uh, take care of mosquitoes and wildlife and bees and bats. We asked Matt about bears. Evidently, they're not going to help you if you have a bear problem. But squirrel, you got a squirrel there. There he is. That's why you want that on my head so we don't have all that noise, isn't it? Sorry about that. This is Carboni's Pizzeria and Bar and Grill. Welcome Carboni's, serving West Lake Minnetonka area with traditional thin crust pizza, hoagies, wraps, burgers and more. We offer a large assortment of beer and a great nightlife. I've had a couple of nights at Carboni's, yeah. <laughs> they have a DJ there every Friday night and they're handing out the, I'll take a dipping dots, come on, there we go. 
Uh, Carbonis also caters. Something to keep in the back of your mind. Thank you, Carbonis. Carbonis has got the dipping dots, kids. Make sure you're ready for them. Look at that. What are you guys? This is Stars and Stirrup Saddle Club. Here come the horses. Look at those. They're beautiful. Hi, ladies. So is this the Saddle Club and State Farm? Or no, you're just you're the Saddle Club. Where are you guys? Where are you located? Um, our meetings are in Rockford, but we pull from the whole surrounding area. Meetings are in Rockford, and if you got a horse, you're in, right? You don't even have to have a horse to join. You don't you have to like horses. You just gotta like horses. Yeah. They'll let you come over and clean the barns, probably. Yeah, probably Absolutely, yeah. 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 Can you read that That's the same thing. Oh, I said, could you read that? That's the pooper scooper right there. There she is. <laughs> Most important job in the parade. Necessary. Necessary. <laughs> <laughs> Next up is uh, Collins Carlson Insurance, State Farm. State Farm is proud to serve the local community. They are conveniently located right down on Three Points. I've seen in a newly remodeled, beautiful office building. Stop by, say hi to Colin. Thanks for supporting us, Colin. Woo! Fairway Independent Mortgage Corporation, the Oliver White team. There they are, all dressed in their green, the Oliver White Fairway Independent Mortgage Corporation, here to help the mortgage buy a home, refinance for a better rate, or cash out your property. Call the Fairway people. How's the candy? Are they giving good candy? Then give them a call. Christians. Christians Insurance. Christians Insurance Restoration in an old restored Mustang. Nicely done, you guys. 
Christians is a locally family-owned business, provides 24-7, 365 day insurance repairs. Wind, fire, storms, that type of thing. Call, Chad, anytime. West Tonka Bus, go ahead, Seth, who do we got there? Uh, West Tonka Bus Service. Wave to those kids. Turk Brothers. Turk Brothers out of St. Bonnie for cars and trucks, and they got some great trailers up there. Turk, thanks for being in the parade. This is a Remax Advantage Plus. There we go. Remax has been firing up the lake for 30 years. Long time top producing real estate agents you know by name and see supporting our community. We know this area at schools, churches, shopping. Remax, consider it sold when you call Carolyn. Thank you. You're welcome. Thanks for being in. Throw some candy. Or you could call Sally. She's yeah. pulling the card. Call Sally if you got a house to sell. Be sure to try, try it. You can get closer to the mic. Just so it makes it sound a little more echoey. Some more of the Landon family name. Been on the lake for a little while anyway. <laughs> this is Mound Mayor Ray Salzar. Ray, you should be here announcing, dude, what happened on this deal. <laughs> Hey, Batman, Batman, right across the street from me, Batman. There's a couple of Skittles right in the road here, dude. You want them? Go, 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 go. There's a race. <laughs> oh, he's sharing. Yeah, that's a good one. Nice job, Batman. This is a Minnesota Lakes Bank. Minnesota Lake Bank, the local bank right up on the corner here, supports Mound and surrounding communities. Come and visit these guys for all of your banking needs. Great group of people. Thanks for being in. Oh, wow, thank you. Yeah, then we can come in. Are you guys throwing candy or are you catching it? Oh, come on, throw a little at me. Come on, throw one at me. There you go. <laughs> Oh, you always can use a boat floater. Always. Thanks. Especially when it's from the... Just from the bank? Oh, get your floaty bobber thing from the bank for your keys. Everybody needs ten of these. <laughs> hey, Batman. Got a bunch right out front here, dude. There's a big Tootsie Roll. That's a good one. There's a big Tootsie Roll. Come on, you guys. You need a little. There's a couple pieces of candy here. Got it. There you go. Next up, we got Girl Scouts of West Tonka and Orno Service Unit. Mmm. The Girl Scouts proudly serve uh, both school districts, including the cities of Independence, Long Lake, Maple Plain, Medina, Minnetonka Beach, Minnetrist, Mount Orono, and Spring Park. Support the Girl Scouts. They had a tough cookie sale this year with the COVID stuff, didn't you? It was a tough year. Did you do good? They said they did great. Nice job, girls. Thank you. Thin Mints. Let's hear it for the Thin Mints.
Next up is the West Tonka Community Theater. Community Theaters presenting their third production this summer, Wizard of Oz, Family Entertainment at its Best. For Dorothy Gale travels over the rainbow. We all know this story. Do we know? I don't have to tell this story. So just announce this we can. We, we can go, let's go we can and we can. Yeah. This is We Can Mobile Market. We can is a switch we had them as We Cab, uh, but they do a great job. Sponsored by the Mound Rotary, who also does a great job in the town. We can support the mobile market. The donation garden. Next up is Dean Phillips for Congress. Dean Phillips running for Congress. Been in the district uh, since 1960. Is that right? Got the Metro van that he calls the governor's repair truck. There he is. Dean's had that truck around for at least four years now, right? Five years? Yeah. He's running his campaign the Minnesota way, not accepting any contributions from special interest. Dean Phillips. Over here we got Our Lady of the Lake Catholic Church. OLL. Don't forget about the 42nd Incredible Festival. Our Lady Catholic School celebrating 70 years this year. Wow, older than me. Along with the parish, OLL provides academic excellence through the Catholic education, guides the growth of all learners while following Christ's examples of love and service. Spots are still available for next year. Great school. Shout out to Nancy Erdman, Mrs. Erdman. If any of you OLL people know Nancy, her birthday's coming up. Make sure to say happy birthday to her in the next week or so. I think she's turning 40. 30. My bad, 30. No, she's coming off the 29 mark this year. What's that? Own it, yeah. Here is Our Lady of the Lake Catholic School. Some more OLLers. Wow, look at all these OLLers. Here's, here's the kids that know Mrs. Erdman right there, yeah. Hey guys, throw some candy, especially on the other side. Throw candy at Batman over there. Oak Ridge. Okay, Oak Ridge what? 
Pet boarding and grooming, yeah. Here's the Oak Ridge Pet Boarding and Daycare. And grooming. And anything for your pet. Oak Ridge Pet Boarding and Daycare specializes in individual pet care. Family owned by the Swanson family for 51 years. Wow, that's an original doggy day camp right there. Next up is Andrew Myers for Minnesota House. Andrew's running for Minnesota House, small business owner, husband, father of four, former city council, currently chairs the Tonka Bay Association, I guess, is running to support students, law enforcement, we like that, and families and small business owners. Good luck, Andrew. Candy, candy, get your votes, Andrew. Hand that candy out. Look at these kids coming in upside down. Seth, who are these guys? The North Shore Gymnastics. There they are, walking on their hands and doing cartwheels. Look at that, holy smokes. Where's that pommel horse? Can you do one or something on the horse right here for the cameras? Yeah, give it a quick stop. North Shore Gymnastics was founded as a nonprofit organization. Been in the community for 40 years. I've 30-year-old daughters that were in their program. It is a great, great program. Uh, they've expanded their gym to 8,000 feet. And they're located in Maple Plain, right off of Highway 12. Look at what, look what you could learn to do. Look at that stuff. Woo. There you go, yeah. Next up is the Spring Park Pharmacy. Spring Park Pharmacy, right in Spring Park, across from the drive-in, been there for years. You can get your prescriptions filled with a large variety of over-the-counter medications. They also have gifts, cards, candy, great store, and probably one of our favorite vehicles in the parade, right there. Everybody needs one of those little trucks. Back channel. Here's the Back yeah. Channel Brewing at Midwest Water Sports. Look at that, what a pair. Boating and barring, I, that, that might work in this community. Yeah. Back Channel's on Seton Channel. We're proud of these guys for what they did. They're doing an unbelievable job over there. Uh, they've expanded, I know that. They embrace the West Tonka community, very supportive. Quality brews, diverse selection, educated staff, and an inviting atmosphere. Stop by the back channel today. You guys are open today, yeah? Yeah, all right. Stop by the back channel. Midwest Water Sports opened its second location in 2018. If you want a celebrity, I'm right here. There, Dan Robertson is in the house. Get Dan on the camera. There he is. <laughs> Midwest Water Sports is on 101 and 7. Nice operation. Go ahead. Caitlin Hill, Senate District 33 DFL, Democratic Party. Welcome. Youth tobacco prevention, we like that. Protect the bees. Be friendly. We like that. Kelly Morrison. 
Here yeah. is uh, Kelly Morrison. Hey. <laughs> and Caitlin Cahill. And Caitlin Cahill. Wait, what is what 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 are they running for? Where are they? What do they do? House districts are our house representatives. Thank you for serving. That's we appreciate that. And nice car, you guys. Here is a uh, Mound West Tonka, D E C A. Deca, greatest way to get out of school. Join Deca if you want to get afternoons off. That's that weekends downtown. Deca is an organization for the kids to learn about entrepreneurship and marketing. Great organization. Read the back of their shirts. They mean business. And they also have a cute little car. Budget blinds, are they on here? Yeah. Okay. Here is a uh, Budget Blinds. Budget Blinds, family owned and operated by Ryan and Nicole Carter. Thank you for being a part of the parade. They're committed to delivering value and great experience for our customers. They are focused on dedicating time and giving back to the communities. Custom window coverings, blinds, drapes, shutters, and more for residential or commercial. They always meet your budget. And they're throwing candy out the back. Throw some candy, budget blinds. There you go. Here's music together, Lakeside. Got it. Music and movement class for children zero to eight years old in Mound and Chanhassen. This is a research-based class taught by local parent Heidi. Heidi, I'm gonna slaughter this. Gusnius, how's that, is that close? Pretty close. Uh, visit musictogetherlakeside.com for more information. They've got a website. Sounds like a lot of fun. Get your kids moving. Here is the prettiest lady in the parade, Lori Casey, throwing frisbees with the Presbyterian Home Group. There they are. Wave at Presbyterian. You might get a frisbee out of you. Hey, Presbyterian, throw a frisbee at Batman over there for me, will ya? Oh, look at this. The second prettiest lady in the parade. And still, oh, look at that. The four prettiest ladies in the parade right there. That convertible. Another Presbyterian Holmes in their matching silver convertibles. Wow. Koala Bear yeah. Child Care. Koala Bear is part of the Presbyterian Homes, too. Been around for enough years that my kids were in it, and a uh, great group of people. Gone downhill a little bit since Linda Wright left. No, I can't say that. Never mind. Presbyterian Homes, Fosse, catch up. Go, 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 you guys. Patty Shaughnessy. Been in Mound since 1962, I think. Yeah, there you go. Here is Dojo Karate. Holy smokes, look at all these karate kids. Dojo Karate is eight locations around the state. They're in Minnetonka, Waconia, and Maple Grove, to say the very least. Big group of kids. Any of you guys got, got, any, got any moves, you guys? Could you show me something? I see a move. Oh, yeah, there. Oh, here they come. Look at that. Yeah. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> you got any moves? <laughs> Here is the Mound Fire Department. That's it, right? Even we don't have that front page. Page one, right there. Say anything about the fire department? We are going to close up with the Mount Fire Department. 95 years. Protect there they are. Future firefighters right there. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
those guys can make some noise, can't they? Let me just throw in that uh, Mound Fire's been around 19, 19, since 90, 95 years. Serves 16,000 residents, Mound, Spring Park, Minnetonka Beach, Shorewood. Staffed by 41 people and they have 17 special emergency vehicles. And then there's the Black Oyak guys, there they are. Following up the parade. Black Oviak, how long? You guys have been around like since the 1900s or something. 1934. <laughs> garbage has been around longer than that. Yeah, not as long as garbage, that is true. Hey, who are you guys? Just throwing candy or are you somebody? Are you, are you, who are you? Black Oviak. Oh, you're part of Black Oviak, okay. No, there, look at the slingshot too, nice car. That is going to conclude on our end of the parade. Feel free to walk up into town, see everybody. They end up up on Auditor's Road by the park. Lots of activities tonight. Uh, let me mention that the fireworks show is going to be spectacular. Thank you to Alan Elmas uh, and Nickham Docks for the fundraising. They actually raised so much funds that they shut it off and started collecting for next year. So. My number I heard is $35,000 worth of fireworks. Going to be a great show at dusk. Happy Spirit of the Lake, Seth Iverson. Thank you very much for helping. Yeah. We will see you guys next year. Bye.